King, King Kong Bundy. A man that has rode roughshod for, for quite some time. He is the biggest, and I mean the biggest member of the Bobby Heenan family. He is from Atlantic City, New Jersey. I think somewhere in the neighborhood of 460 pounds. King Kong Bundy. Welcome back. What do you, you, know what do you got in your mind? I, I love those words, run roughshod. What better could describe King Kong Bundy in the ring, out of the ring, every aspect of his life? Maybe the heavyweight champion world is never a dead issue. I'm the perennial. That means always, all the time, forever, number one contender for the World Wrestling Federation Heavyweight Championship. You, you know that. You know, I've been in Hollywood. I've been, doing, I've been doing movies. I've been doing commercials. I've been doing a lot of things. But, but don't ever think that I forgot it and, and forgot about the heavyweight championship of the world. You know, let me clarify everything by saying what you think is of no consequence whatsoever. It, it matters what I think. That's all that matters. That's, that's exactly what I'm saying. See, Gina, the difference is guys like you have to insinuate and beat around the bush. People like me come right out and say what they mean. You know, on the highway of life, I'm a Mack truck. And when you're a Mack truck, you don't need any road manners. You do what you want, you say what you want. Big, big King Kong Bundy. Six, six foot six, 455 pounds. The, the, the biggest man of professional wrestling. And, and you know what makes me sick? What, what's been making me sick since I've been here? It, it's them having the nerve, these promoters having the goal to put me in the ring with one man. I, I should be in the ring with a minimum of two men at one time. I, I don't care who it is. Give me the, give me any two men. It, it doesn't matter who they are. I, I want to see somebody put King Kong Bundy down. It's never been done, and it's never going to be done here. The, the only man in the history of professional wrestling to demand a five pin. And, and the reason for that is, I don't want anybody getting beat by King Kong Bundy and coming out of that ring and saying they got a fast count and they didn't really lose. When Bundy puts you down, when I, when I put you in that corner and, and give you that big avalanche, and, and you fall flat on your face, and I roll you on your back, and the referee counts to five, then there's no doubt in anybody's mind, you've been beat. Well, well, it might be a little more than 468. This guy just whistled through four plates of H. Benedict. King, King Kong Bundy. You know, you know, little man, wouldn't it make a lot more sense to call me King Kong Bundy? Six foot five inches tall, 468 pounds. How, how is he going to pile drive 468 pounds of, of King Kong Bundy? Can you, can you picture that happening? Can, can you see that happening? And yet you take Davila as the greatest move in professional wrestling. 3,000 3, pounds per... Well, well, it might be a little more than 468. Oh, put baby oil all over his body. I suggest King, King Kong Bundy. You know, you know, little man, wouldn't it make a lot more sense to call me King Kong Bundy? Six foot five inches tall, 468 pounds. Oh, man. You better get ready, you know, there ain't gonna be no pose down. Uh, uh, King Kong. Can you, can you picture that happening? Can you see that happening? And yet you take the avalanche, the greatest move in professional wrestling. 3,000 3, pounds per square inch when I hit. I yeah, yeah. put baby oil all over his body. I suggest people in the first 63 rows wear a raincoat. Because when this man hits them, he's going to knock all the oil off him so hard, people are going to be sliding out of that building. You, you better fight. get ready, you know, there's ain't going to be no pose down. It's going to be a fight. If I take care of you, I'm going to win the battle royal.